Cincinnati police are working meticulously through dates, locations, and evidence to figure out exactly what happened to 29-year-old Nitisha Lattimore, a Walnut Hills mom with a three-year-old son, Nilo, who appeared to be her world. According to arrest records, around 9 a.m. on Friday, December 11th, 20-year-old Deshaun Brown stabbed Lattimore several times with an edged weapon at an apartment on Melrose Avenue. Police cite physical and video evidence, as well as witness statements and the charging documents against Brown. Lattimore's body Body was found near the Purple People Bridge Saturday, according to detectives. Today, Cincinnati police and divers with the Hamilton County Police Association searched the Ohio River near Gateman's Cove Park looking for any sign of Nilo. They say family members identified a stroller there that appears to have belonged to the mother and son. Investigators say the three-year-old hasn't been seen since December 4th, but were unable to elaborate on a more detailed timeline. As far as Brown's criminal history in Hamilton County, earlier this year he faced charges for a obstructing official business and falsification. He was also convicted of assault in January, according to Montgomery County court records, and given five years probation. But the question remains, where is Nilo? And right now, Brown is charged with murder here in Hamilton County. He's set to face a judge first thing in the morning. Reporting live downtown, Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5. Now, Dan, I know you spent a lot of time out there this afternoon. Have you been able to talk with any family members about Nilo or his mother? Well, just briefly, Molly, they're pretty emotional about all this, working through the loss, and also just wondering where Nilo is. At this point, it appears they really just want their privacy. All right, Dan Griffin reporting live for us downtown tonight. Thanks, Dan.